So I was on YouTube yesterday and I came across this stack cards video. This looks cool, right? But once I started making this, I found out that the code actually doesn't work perfectly. So once you scroll, you'll see this issue. And it's not just me. A lot of people in the comment section also had this issue. So I took it upon myself to fix it and I did. Here's what the fixed effect looks like. The cards shift up smoothly and then when you scroll back up, they get stacked again. So today I'll show you how I made this card stack effect and I'll also leave the fixed code in the description below. Okay, I've already designed the cards for this. There are four cards in total right behind one another, as you can see in the navigator. So make sure you've got the cards prepared too. Now let's jump right into adding the stack cards effect. First, select the main container that holds all the elements. Then go to advanced and scroll down to the CSS classes. Here you need to type mdw dash stacked dash card dash area. Once that's done, we need to add the custom CSS code for it. But before that, whenever I'm doing some design work for clients, I make sure to install this free plugin Airlift because, okay, let me actually show you this. So that's my site speed before and that's after. It does a lot of optimizations automatically and keeps stuff fast. So you should definitely try this and I'll leave the link in the description below. Now let's jump right into adding the stack cards effect. We need to add the custom CSS code for it. This is important for the effect to work, so don't forget this step. Just scroll down to the CSS code area, click here, and paste the code from the description box below. Here, you can adjust the height that you want the cards to scroll to, their rotation angle, and the transition time. All right, now go to the navigator, select the container with all the cards, go to advanced settings, and go down to CSS classes area. Enter mdw-stacked-cards here. For the last step, we need to add HTML code. So click on widgets and find the HTML widget. Drag and drop it over the images in your section. Now let's place it under the main container that has all our cards. Then go to description, copy the code, come back and paste it here. This HTML code adds the scrolling effect to our cards and the CSS code adds the animation. And that's it guys, you just have to hit publish and look at the final result. As you can see, the stack card effect works properly. Comment below if you have any questions and I'll help you out. Click this video if you want to triple your site speed in just one minute. You're really gonna thank me for this. So click here and I'll see you there.